Hi, I'm Evan at Marvel's Kids Museum, and today I want to do an activity with you that's all about magnetic fields. Did you know that the Earth has a magnetic field all around it, and that's what causes a compass to point north? The magnetic field that Earth has actually protects us from space debris and other cosmic radiation. Earth's magnetic field has two ends, the north and south pole. We'll explore this concept with this activity right here. So this is the Earth, with a magnet going through the middle of it. So this is going to act as our north and south pole, north and south. What I'll do is I'll take a pencil with a push pin and a piece of paper clip attached to it right here, and I'll just move it around the Earth. What do you observe happening to the paper clip when I move it around the Earth? When the paperclip was over one of the poles of the planet, it seemed to pull really strongly in the direction of that pole. This shows that the poles have the strongest magnetic fields. You can do this activity at home. All you'll need is a magnet from your refrigerator, a pencil, a push pin, and a piece of paperclip. Move this device around a magnet and watch the paperclip be attracted to it. Play around, see how far away you can get without feeling that magnetic pull, and see if you can get it to spin. We can take this a step further by taking some metal small paper clips like this and pouring them on Earth to see what happens. Hmm, where do you think the strongest magnetic field will be? Will it be in the center of Earth or at one of the poles? Let's find out. Ooh. Some are sticking there. Where do they seem to stick? On the center of the Earth or at the poles? I think the poles. And you can see these are hanging down. So that magnetism actually travels through that metal and connects them to each other. Let me see if I can connect one pole to the other. They don't seem to want to connect. So the Earth has a magnetic field what about the sun? The sun has magnetism too, but it isn't quite as uniform as the poles of the earth. Let's pour some metal pieces on the sun and see where the magnetism is. Hmm, is it all over the sun or is it just on specific spots? It seems to be localized in these areas. Hmm, wonder why that is. These are sunspots. We can see sunspots when we look at the sun through a telescope. Sunspots are caused by magnetic anomalies inside of the sun and can throw off huge amounts of magnetic energy. Earth's own magnetic field protects us from this energy, but sometimes some of those particles can get through, and we see those as auroras, or the northern lights. The location of sunspots can shift. They won't always be in this spot forever, so they could go from here to down here to the other side. You can explore magnets and magnetism even more at home. Share your experiments with us on social media at Marvel's Kids Museum. We'll see you next time.